Hey friends, it's Miss Piper. I wanted to talk to you guys today about recycling. In class, we start talking about recycling and all the different things we can recycle. If you haven't heard of that word before, recycling, let me tell you a little bit more about it. So recycling is when we can use something over again. So I'll show you some things that we can recycle. So here I have a toilet paper roll. So we could recycle, instead of throwing it in the garbage, we could recycle it and we could use it to make a microphone like we did at some of your houses. Or if we have two, we could put them together and make some binoculars. We could take a giant paper towel roll and do a few different things with it. Think about some things maybe you could do to reuse this. Hmm. Some of my friends this week said that they could color it and they could make a telescope or they could cut it in half and make binoculars. They could use it as a tunnel and put a car or a ball through there and see if it falls out. Uh, you, could you, you could get two of them and use them as drums to make some music. So instead of throwing away our paper towel roll, we could reuse it or recycle it. Another thing you could reuse or recycle is if you have a water bottle or a pot bottle, you can empty it, dump everything out of it and clean it and then take the wrapper off and then fill it with fun things. So this one has beads and some googly eyes and some pom-pom and then just make it be a shaker. And in class, we have some that are filled with water. We have one that's filled with sand and pumpkins right now um, and some green grass to make it look like a pumpkin patch. So you can reuse or recycle a lot of things. The recycle symbol looks like this. So if you see a triangle with three green arrows, and sometimes they're just white or clear arrows, but a triangle with three arrows, that means that you can recycle that thing. So let's see on the bottom of this bottle. Oh, might be tricky to see, but on the bottom of this bottle right here is that triangle, which means you can reuse it and recycle it. So I gave you guys some homework of different things that you guys can work on um, to learn more about recycling. So I hope that you guys can do that. Ooh, one thing in my bucket, one thing we can recycle or reuse is some paper. So I have this paper and I didn't need it anymore and I didn't want to throw it in the garbage can. So I just, I have this side that's blank. So I put it in my recycle bin so that I know that if I want to color, I can maybe just use that side or I can put it in the recycle bin and they can take it to the recycle factory and reuse that paper. So we'll learn more about that later. So I wanna read you a fun little story today about recycling. It has a cute little puppy on it and look at there's the three arrows right there. And it says, Sam helps recycle. So let's see. Hi, my name is Sam. I'm helping Maya and her mom recycle our trash. I hear Maya calling me now. I gotta go. Some of our trash goes into garbage cans. The rest goes into a recycle bin. Maya has a big stack of newspapers ready. Wait a minute. I have to get that newspaper I hid behind the bushes. I'll add it to the stack. Cans and glass bottles are next. We put them in a separate bin. Hey, are you throwing away my dog food? No, it's okay. Those cans are already empty. So look at that, they can recycle the dog's food cans if they're cleaned out. Plastic goes in the last recycle bin. I run to get a bottle I left in the yard. I don't want to litter. So littering is another thing we'll learn about. Littering is when you throw your garbage on the floor and we do not litter because animals could try and eat that stuff and get hurt and you can get in big trouble for littering. When I come back, I get a surprise. My food bowl's in the recycle bin. Why are they throwing my food bowl away? Look at that. Mm, looks like he chewed it up. He needs a new one. Before I can save my bowl, Maya calls me to get into the car. She says we're going to the recycling center. We also bring some old batteries and some unused paint. It's not safe to keep them around. So they load up their car with all the recycle stuff. In some towns, sanitation workers pick up the trash on one day and recycling bins on another day. Where we live, we do our recycling ourselves. Maya's mom starts the car. Here we go. 
So at Miss Piper's house, I have my garbage truck come on Tuesdays and I have recycling come on Wednesdays and they pick up my all my recycling. Look, here's all the recycling they put in there. So I'm gonna stop here for now and I'm gonna finish reading this one later. So we'll learn more about what Sam does to help recycle. All right, see you later, friends.